Hey everyone and welcome back to another tutorial. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to live stream to WP Stream using Wirecast. First things first, you're going to go to the WordPress website on your account and on the sidebar, there's the plugins. You're going to click on plugins and click on add new. This is going to take you to all of the featured plugins, but you're going to have to type in WP Stream and this is what's going to show up. Now you click on install now and on activate and just wait. This is going to take you back and right at the bottom you'll find WP Stream. Now on the sidebar again, click on WP Stream and you'll see that you have to connect an account so click on the link and this is going to take you straight to the wp stream registration or login page type in your name first name last name your email address and your password make sure it's strong click on i'm not a robot and register Now it took you to your account page in WP Stream, so go back to WordPress and type in your email and your password that you just used to register yourself with. Click on save changes and you've been connected to WPStream.net. Now on the sidebar, click on free live channels, free videos and add new. Once you've done that, make sure to give your new channel a name. I'm just naming it my first channel, but you can be as creative as you want. Click on publish, you'll find a permalink show up and click on publish once again. Now you're gonna click on yes to record and click on broadcast the channel. This is gonna take about one or two minutes, but for the purpose of this video I just fast forwarded it so that's why it took a little bit less time than usual now that that's done you're gonna click on broadcast with third party there's the server and stream key and now the third party in question is Wirecast so on the left you'll see what i'm planning to broadcast go to output right at the top and click on output settings you'll find your destination as rtmp just click on ok and you'll find the address and stream for the address you're going to go back to wordpress and click on copy to clipboard paste on the address and as for stream again go back copy the stream key and paste it here once again. Now that that's done, click on OK. And right between these two parts, you'll find the, the double arrow, just click. And now on the bottom, just click the arrow again, and you'll find the video on the right side as well. Now go on Output and click on Start All, as in to start broadcasting. Go back to the WordPress website and click on the permalink that I mentioned earlier. Now this is how your live stream is going to look like. Now go back on Wirecast and click on output once again and click on stop all in order to stop your broadcast. Once you've gone back, you will see that it's no longer broadcasting and it's paused. So that's that for live broadcasting. Now I'll show you how to create a video on demand. So go on WP Stream on the sidebar and click on WP Stream Media Management. You'll go on Create New Free VOD from this video, click on it. And once again, type in a name for your VOD or video on demand. I'm naming it my new VOD and I'm going to click on publish similar to last time and now you're just going to go and click on the permalink. 
This is going to take you to your VOD. And once you click play, you'll see your video on demand right here. So this is from what you've just live streamed. The great thing about video on demand is that you can fast forward, you can go back, you can pause, um, you can play it again. So you can do whatever you want with your video on demand. Now that's that for this video. Thank you all so much for watching and I hope to see you soon with another tutorial.